that it didn't bother him. Tackling is, of course, part of the game, but research is now linking repeated concussions in football with debilitating brain diseases. To keep players safer, a Boston company has designed a new helmet called the Zenith X1. It cushions the skull, providing more protection for the players. Some pro players are already using it, and so are some Canadian university teams, including Simon Fraser University. Dave Johnson is the school head football coach, and he's with us this morning from Vancouver. Good morning. Good morning. And, Coach, I guess you've, you've, got, you've, you've got a helmet there with you. This one of the Zenith ones? I do. So tell me something yes. in terms of the success rate, because you... I gather it was in 2008 that a number of concussions plagued your football team, so you were started looking for some other uh, answer to this. I did. It, it, the concussion has been a real issue for us, and uh, not only that it takes uh, quality players and good players off the field, but there are lingering effects that actually affects their university schoolwork. So after the 2008 season where we uh, lost four players through the course of the, that year, um, I went searching, thinking there's got to be a, you know, a, a helmet that does, is doing a better job, and I came across the, uh, the Zenith helmet, and we've been very pleased with it uh, in the last two years. So tell me what you know, what kind of success rate it had. You, they, these guys were wearing it, and but there were concussions on the team, right? Yeah, well, a matter of fact, we even had three concussions on uh, our, this last weekend. Um, but interesting, again, none of those players were wearing the Zenith helmet. Through the course of this year, we're probably at nine or ten players that have had some degree of concussion, and there are degrees to that. But uh, to date, uh, through the course of last season and so far this year, uh, we are betting a thousand percent with the Zenith that, that nobody has suffered a, a concussion where they've wow. missed either school time or missed playing time. That is incredible. How did the wheel get reinvented in this case? I mean, the, from the traditional helmet, what is it about this helmet? I'm, I'm not an engineer, but from my uh, perspective, uh, the traditional helmet, the head can move around in the helmet. Well, with the Zenit, there, inside the helmet, there's a bonnet that pulls tight uh, around the helmet. So it's the helmet that moves around the head. So um, the way it is designed is just dramatically different. And there are no parts that can break. There are no air bladders. Um, everything is wired where uh, th there's no parts that you have to worry about them falling apart or breaking. And that's critical because, as I understand it, in terms of the technology of a helmet, I mean, even one hit and the helmet, the traditional helmet is not as effective. What are the players saying about in terms of comfort or what, how they feel about it? I, again, I think initially there was some resistance because it's, it looks a little different and it feels a little different, but um, all of the uh, protection inside the helmet is adjustable. So it, it, this should be the most comfortable helmet uh, that our players put on, just because it can be customized to their individual size and the shape of their head. Not that, you know, you, you want to talk about money in terms of um, preventing injury. Of course, there's no um, price that can be paid for that, but it is a more expensive helmet, right? It, it is the most expensive helmet on the market. Uh, that is true. Um, but again, in 2008, when I had a couple of players sitting in my office weeping because they couldn't even ride the bus, uh, let alone go to school or, or go to lecture and certainly not attend practice, I, I just felt like our, we demand so much of our players and uh, that, that we needed to provide, if there was a, a better product out there, that we needed to go the extra mile to make sure they were protected. So if you were talking to any other, say, high school coaches or other, you know, university coaches, you'd say? I have been 100% pleased with, with this helmet. And as uh, I don't get paid for this. And we don't get free helmets, uh, interestingly enough. And with my budget, I could use a couple. Yeah, but uh, long, story short, long story short, our, uh, you know, our players have been happy. Our physio and, and uh, doctor medical staff has uh, been very pleased. And to date, in the last year and a half, we've had great results. Coach Johnson, thanks so much for joining us to talk about the helmet. You're welcome.